Don't blink, it's your boy Ink. Welcome to Real Captain of the Show. Catherine doing well. Catherine are having a phenomenal day on this 14th of August 2024. This is my last video of the day. This is, we've been doing a lot of videos today. You gotta see the sunrise. It's a shame. It's almost dead. Uh, now the sun is not dead. The sun will never, well, it will die, but not right now. Um, we're doing a video that's actually pretty special. Um, I'm gonna get bitten by mosquitoes. Today's video is too many choices can be detrimental. So, um, I don't remember why I wanted to do this video. I don't remember the concept behind it. But we're, we're giving. Mm, why would I make this video? I know the subject kind of the, the concept, but I don't remember the why. So sadly, today this video will not have a why. Um, the fact that we have so many so many choices when it comes to relationship, when it comes to dating application, when it comes to platform to post social media or to watch social media, when it comes to show, when it comes to Hulu, Netflix, Amazon. Disney, uh, we have so much choice in life. Now, so much choice in life is usually a good thing, right? Oh, my apologies. We're going to be talking about why it's not a good thing. Um, my apologies. See, when my father, my father was from the boondocks. Not the boondocks, boondocks, but it was from a, a farm town. And at school, they only had six choices. So no matter what he had in mind, he wanted to follow a course, he had six choices. Even if none of them were interesting, he said, okay, well, it's one I don't really mind doing. And uh, to me, that is something that is crazy cool because um, the number of choice. You see, the whole concept behind FOMO, fear of missing now, the whole concept behind, um, I don't know if I made the right choices because there are so many choices. We, we, we came from a part that says, what choice do I have? And we ended up in a place where all, all the other choices seem like shit, you know? Um, or did I do the right choice? And I feel like it. I feel like it's detrimental because we are we are able to make mistakes. We're human, able to make mistakes. But the mistake should the fact that the mistake come from the world in itself versus the fact that the mistake come from you is very different. Uh, the fact that we have so many choices um, is also detrimental in the fact that it is <laughs> it is very easy to make a choice. It is very hard to make the right choices. Um, that being detrimental is another fashion of Listen, um, it's not so much your choice that matters, it's the choice of others. Uh, if we all had so much limited choices, um, we could all... It's weird because it can... I feel like what I'm trying to say is limited choices actually as an excuses. Then an excuse... Am I trying to say that, oh, if I don't have the choice, then whatever I do, it's not my fault. It could be an excuse. Of course it could be an excuse. Everything could be an excuse to a certain degree. But there's also the fact that we 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 we're promoting the fact that these or choices that we have to make we're promoting choices that were were imposed on us and i don't know if that's something um i don't know dude i don't know but the issue is i usually go with those videos i usually go with the why then the what i think but i i had this idea at like six yesterday and it's now seven fifteen this morning so um of course, I mean, a lot of choice is detrimental. Um, having a lot of uh, music to watch to, and it's hard to say that too much choice is negative because um, it's always going to be positive. The more choice you have, the more opportunity you get, right? But not all of those opportunities are correct. Um, I'm in between jobs right now, and there's time. I'll be honest. There's time where I do post on a CV. There's a lot of time where I, I I'll, I'll go to job application, right? Um, because it's a it's a reality, you know, and um, my apologies, and um, the fact that I don't know where I would work, the fact that I don't have any interest in a particular place is possibly a lack of interest, or because I have too many choices. If I was living in a smaller town, and uh, I'd be like, yeah, there's not a lot of place to work here. I, I should work there and there and there, but um, there's not a lot of town that's smaller than Lachine. So the the over choice. I remember. I'm gonna talk about my father once again, but I remember being in a small city and there's not a lot of people there to get married to. So since the gene pool, since the the amount of children that you have is small, you're extremely excited, extremely grateful when it happens. Our parents were saying married for longer because they knew that they didn't have a lot of choice. Now with social media, if it doesn't work, I'll choose somebody else. And I don't know. I don't know if that's a good thing. 
Anywho, that's a weird video. I'm sorry. I love you that you met. I'll see you guys soon. Take it easy.